Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. How do you control your anger, even when you know that somebody is in the wrong? You know, you try and tell yourself once, twice that, you know, I have to keep quiet, but it still comes out. How do you control anger? By s spiritual strength. Anger is like an enemy that we have to fight within ourselves. Yes? Now, if there's a war, do you just take people off the street and send them to the battlefield? Or do you train them as soldiers first? If you want them to be effective, you have to train them as soldiers first. One trained soldier who's properly armed can overcome hundreds and hundreds of just people off the street who come to fight. Yes? So in the same way, we know that these enemies of lust and envy and arrogance, anger, greed, illusion, we know they will attack. They will attack both from within and without. We must fight. We must fight against that anger when it comes. But at the same time, we have to be strong in order to succeed. And that means to cultivate spiritual strength by cultivating proper knowledge, by hearing harikata, the topics about God, by chanting God's names, this is a wonderful way of accessing the mercy and the strength of God. By prayer, to access the help of God. If we train ourselves properly through sadhana, then when these enemies like anger attack, still we have to fight, but we'll have the power to win. And to get angry for the right purpose is also a good thing. Anger could be used in God's service too. Hanuman was very angry. But his anger was to help people. Sometimes a mother is angry with the child. Don't do this or you will, I will punish you. Now, if anger is an outburst of uncontrolled emotion due to frustration, that is very karmically entangling. But if anger is a tool to actually do things in a very effective way, then it's an asset in our life. But in order to use it for that purpose, we have to have inner spiritual strength. Does that answer your question? Yes. Thank, Thank you. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. You were listening to Radhanath Swami on devotionalnectar.com. <laughs>